One of the major talking points that I really reiterate in my article is how traditional art, the hands-on stuff, is going to be more adaptable and transform into virtual reality. Um, the fact that you have controllers and maybe weighted objects that you can use in virtual reality and actually use your motion and energy and move through your designs, almost like a performance piece while you're creating with your imagination. And also allowing you to change various settings. So for example, you could be painting and inspired in a background virtually in France while uh, feeling um, that inspiration and emotion and the hands-on actual tools while you're in virtual reality. Um, there's going to be a big transformation, I predict, uh, in regards to uh, the hands-on. Uh, you saw it in film and then to the digital, but at least with virtual reality, you'll start to get a feel for the objects more rather than being at a keyboard and mouse.